Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so here we are in Folksar. Let's wander down the path. I don't really know where we're going. Um, I'm sure we will eventually run across something interesting. Um, yeah, I don't know if uh, there's a way back to Skyrim from here. So we'll adventure in here for a while. Um, depending upon how difficult things are in here. We may stay through the whole rest of the uh, the mod until we finish it. Um, perhaps not. I tried to look online and see what the recommended levels were for this, and it was very vague. Um, some people said it was hard. Some people said it wasn't. So I have not a clue. Hey, over. They say the lighthouse is haunted by ghosts, and anyone who goes in there is never seen again. Uh, um. Not that I believe in that nonsense. Sure. Where are we going? Crossing the river. Yeah, it looks like we are. We're fording the river. Fair enough. Doesn't appear to be a whole lot around here. A few things here and there. Um, there's a town on our left. So that way. Um, ah, here's a signpost. Maybe this will tell us where to go. Amber Creek, River Watch Hot Springs. Um, let's take a look at our journal. Speak with Jarl Agner in Amber Creek. Well, okay, let's do that. We can speak with the, the Jarl. Got my gang with me. This must be the place, huh? And creek. Sure, sure. Um Odin's house. We got a sawmill up there. This must be the inn. We have one of these deals. Hello, who are you? Yes. Oh, hey, dude. Like personal space, man. Jeez, right up in. Um, what can you tell me about Amber Creek? Amber Creek is named after the small stream it was built next to. This stream was, at the time, full of a rich mineral called Amber. However, over the years the Amber was all mined out. The creek slowly expanded, and eventually became a large river, like it is today. That Amber fueled the growth of the town. Since then, we have adapted to make gold through other means. For some, trade. For others, farming. Then there are those who make gold through craft. Like me with my smithing. How can I get the scar from here? Definitely by boat. Fortunately, Wolf still runs one down at the docks. Speak to him if you are interested in passage to Skyrim. Ah, okay. There we go. That's good. Passage home. Um, say the best blacksmith in folk, sorry. I owe it all to my father. He taught me everything I know. His father taught him, and his father before, and so on. Our family has run this blacksmith since Amber Creek was founded. Though, I fear I have no child to pass my knowledge on to. And I never will. Not after what happened to my wife. 
but I do have Micaias. I don't think my father would mind that he isn't my son too much. It's about the knowledge, the craft, the skill. All that matters is that I teach something. And one day, before I die, I'll craft my masterpiece. Just like my father did, even if it was taken from me. Um, what happened to your wife? She was visiting Pine Whale when it was attacked. About 20 years back. She... She didn't make it. She... She was pregnant at the time. I've moved on as she would have wanted me to. But I fear I'm too old to have kids now. Not that I could ever find another woman as beautiful and flawless as my Annelie. Someone stole your father's masterpiece? Yes. Yeah. Many years ago, my father grabbed the Jarl, Agnar's father, a great warhammer. Years later, when my father passed away, Agnar returned it to my family. We buried it with my father, in his honor. Any blacksmith should rest with the finest of his craft. But one day we found his grave dug up. The hammer was gone, stolen by someone. You know, I'm gonna have to go find it. Evidence, but I know it was stolen by Garand. His family was always jealous of mine. Last I heard, he was hiding out at the old Aspenfall Lodge, to the southeast in the Amber Hole. I haven't a clue if he's still there, but it's certainly worth a try. If you can find my father's hammer, I will be greatly appreciative. Yep. I have some questions. Search Aspenfall Lodge for signs of I have some questions about your father and the Geralt. Right. What is it you aim to know? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What's going on between family grounds? Oh, there's nothing to that really. We were skilled blacksmiths. And they were not so skilled. They couldn't handle that fact, so they always held a grudge on us. They would try to stop us from doing our work. Steal supplies, tame patches of ore. Things like that. But this is by far the most rotten thing Garen's done. Anything else? Um, how come I've never heard of Grant or his family before? Probably because they haven't lived in town for a while now. They were always an unpleasant bunch. So nobody around here likes to remember them. He's pulled a stunt like this. So he's probably resorted to bandaging or some other form of stealing to get along. If he were to disappear while you we were looking for the hammer, I wouldn't exactly mind if you catch my trick. Anything else? No, nope, got it. That's all I wanted to know. Very well. Wait, what up? All right, what is it you aim to What happened know? to the question about your wife? What happened to your wife? She was visiting Pineway when it was attacked. About 20 years back. I already said this. She... She didn't make it. She... Okay. That I I've already seen else. this. That's all I wanted to know. Very well. Uh, what can I buy a horse? I think the only spare horse we have in town is Gabriel's. He doesn't use it anymore, so he may sell it to you. What do you got for sale? Just about anything you can forge out of metal or leather. Uh, okay, you got some stuff. Um, anything you want to mine? Anything that I can afford to get rid of? Um, Scourge. Hmm. Uh, you want a silver dagger? I don't need this. Um, how's my weight doing? It's all right, but it's the Skinner's silver dagger. That seems like a, a unique weapon. Um, this like you can have. I don't need that. I don't need a silver dagger either, or an iron dagger. Um, I'm 
dragon hide. You can have this small metal plate. I don't know why I have this. Um, I think we're good. Oh, do more. You can have the do more. Um, the heralds as well. You can have those. I don't need them. Uh, it's all good. Just ingots. I'll take those back to the museum at some point. Okay, I'm done with you. Do my best. Guard and someone else found me and got me out. Well, by all means, go inside. Have a drink and get some rest. Yeah. Actually, I think I'd like to stay out here and do some work with you. It'll be good for me. Of course. Grab a hammer. It's great to have you back. Mm, okay. So, um. Nope, nope. And now we're auto saving. Fair enough. One hand for your weapon. Okay, let's see what we got here. Uh Sky Complete Foxar. We are in Well, we don't have the Creek Mine. Um quite a few locations. I always thought you had good wrist action. Then again, women can be quite good with their hands. Let's go check out. Oh, there's a guy. Who are you? Oh, you're just a guard. All right, let's go check out the end. See who's in here. Wait, there's a guy over here cutting wood. Rook. I love Amber Creek. Do you know a lot of songs? I know plenty of songs. I wish I knew more though. The bards kind of died off a while ago. I've been trying to recollect their work for years. However, some of the pieces are harder to get to than others. Right now, I believe there's one in the ruins of Holmer called the Wandering Bard. I'd love to have it. If you have any spare time and could get it for me, I'll buy it off you. I'll pay good too. Sure. Songs of the Dead. Um. Farewell. Sure, I'll see you later. Who are you? Oh. Join your time in Amber Creek. What can you tell me about this? It was founded when the Borvalders left Borvald a few years after its construction. Olaf wanted something more peaceful. I guess he wasn't the kind of man who wanted to be king. He just happened to be brave and courageous. My family built the mill and helped Olaf build the town. I know every building here like the back of my hand, and I keep them all in good condition. Do you help with anything? Yes, I recently found something that's been troubling me. I was out logging and I found a note from Yonel, a childhood friend of mine. It said that the bandits at Stone Ridge Watch were planning to attack Amber Creek. I've been looking for someone to investigate. Consider it done. If you're interested, please let me know. I'll pay you. Yep. I can help out. Great. Please, go to Stone Ridge Watch along the top of the cliffs, far to the southeast. See if you can find the bandits that plan on attacking you. Far to the southeast. Oh, and if Yonald is somehow alive, please bring him back here. I'd very much like to speak with him and see him again. Um, I had some questions. Sure, what can I tell you? What happened to John Love? Several years ago, he was taken. Kidnapped. Bandits wanted to hold him for ransom, as his father was a wealthy man. However, before news could even reach his father back in Skyrim, the man died from old age. The bandits gave up on the ransom. We all assumed that Yonald was dead. If he's alive, I want him brought back safely. Please, try to do this, along with stopping the attack, of course. Maybe if he's at the watch, he can help you. Can I tell you anything else? Oh my gosh. 
Why can't you go? Why can't I, a lumberjack, go to a cliff-top bandit-ridden fortress to stop an assault on the village? Hmm. Sure, I've got some training with a sword, but little real combat experience. I wouldn't stand a chance. You, on the other hand, are far more experienced, and I know you can get the job done. Plus, if Amber Creek is attacked, I want to be here to defend it. My family built this town, and I'll be damned if I let it get destroyed. Can I tell you anything else? Should we tell someone about this? I have. I warned Yama the instant I found the letter. She tried to reassure me that the town already has enough guards and that it will be okay. I don't think we have nearly enough. If we got attacked, especially by a larger force, we'd be in hot water. You need to stop the attack before it can even occur. Takata, damn it. Can I tell you anything else? Where'd you find the note? I was selecting lumber, just out of town, when I found the note from Yano. He must have left it somewhere he knew I would find it. I didn't even know he was alive. I hope he's okay. Watch your head. Can I tell you anything else? I was swinging that axe around. Um, how do you know the roses? How do you know? kids. We had these wooden swords that we would spar with, playfully. We hadn't used them in years. When I found the note, it was attached to his wooden sword, which was stuck into the ground. He must have had it with him. Only he would know what that meant. That's how I know he wrote that letter. Can I tell you anything else? That's it. Please, hurry. If an attack is in, I'd rather it was prevented. A pleasure as always. Okay, apparently my lamp is on. For the love of Pete. Okay, um, now we can go into the inn. Maybe. Who are you? Rook, I've already talked to you. Hey, hello. Okay, we got some people in here. Jola. I get you anything? Um. Uh, well, I don't need anything from you at all. Guess not. Safe travels. It's very good, sweetie. Laura. One day you'll be just like Clark. Um, what do you do for fun around here? Oh, a few things. Mainly talking with friends, or joining them in song and dance. I also enjoy taking walks along the Amber River. It's so relaxing. We even used to spend time at the hot springs up river, though lately nobody has gone there much. Something is off. It feels so dreadful. Other than that, I sometimes read, though I also think cooking is fun, and I often give lessons to Varina. She's such an adorable little chef. She's getting pretty good, too. Dang it, Gabriel. What was that about the hot springs? Recently, the springs have felt off. It's hard to explain. You go there, and there is simply a feeling of dread or misery. It's usually so bad that you want nothing more than to leave and get away. It only started recently, but I haven't a clue what could be causing it. If you looked into it, I'd be in your debt. We all would. I'm sure I will. The springs are something this town has enjoyed for a long time, and it would be wonderful to be able to visit them once again. Dread Aura. Okie dokie then. See ya. Harold. What brings you to Amber Creek? A series of dashed hopes and dreams. I heard of a large ring of amber ore that Svea's store sold long ago that was lost. I need that ring, but I haven't a clue where it is. The trail has run dry, and I appear to be out of luck. If you're interested, you could find the ring and bring it back to me. Talk to Wolf at the docks. He may tell you something that he didn't tell me. Okie dokie. What do you know about the amber ring? Just that it was sold to a merchant many years ago and then lost. Ask Wolf at the docks. He may tell you something useful. And please... If you find it, bring it to me. Alright. Where's Svea? That's Clara. Rook. Turned at last to the suffer north, he told his noble tale. Fixed the heart to an anchor point and it's okay. then unveil. Let's take care of that real fast. Uh, 
That should take care of that. Alright. Where's um with five name keys was the wondrous heart of the god. Oh there's Sophia. Well, I seem to have talked to everybody in here. Let's go see if we can find some of these people, like Wolf and Zvea. Okay. Um lost the game. Alright, we're looking for Svea or Wolf. Who are you? You're the special one that came through that old gateway, aren't you? I bet Skyrim is amazing. What do you do around here? I help Clara with the cooking. She's teaching me all sorts of things, and I'm getting better and better. You teach me how to cook anything. You want me to teach you how to cook stuff? Even though I'm just a child? Sure. Wow, all this practice is finally paying off. The best part is that I made up most of the recipes on my own, so you won't find them anywhere else. We'll start with my specialty. I noticed that nobody ever uses bread in their stews, so I gave it a try. For this recipe, you'll need a nice piece of salmon, some salt, cabbage, and a great loaf of bread. Here's a list of ingredients in case you forget. Collect those and cook it, then bring some to me so I can try it and make sure you did it right. Okay. Farina. Sure. Okay, bye. Is that an actual quest? That's confusing. Um It's not a radiant quest. It doesn't appear to be Amber Creek. Yarl two from the oh no Kalevi. Um Halma Tread Aura, which is a Daedra quest. Okay. This appears to be like one of the major towns in this area because it's got a bunch of the quests. Um sure. Ragnar. Mm -hmm. No, I've already talked Have to you. A nice day. If you need anything, just let me or Rangar know. Oh, uh, he's tell me about Falskar. Falskar is a complex land. We've had a lot of war and death. Things have been pretty dark the last few years, but I think we'll pull through. After all, Olaf led our people through the treachery when we first arrived here. I'm sure Ragnar will do the same for us now. What are you doing around here? I help Rangar around the forge. I'm his apprentice. He hasn't had any children to pass the knowledge on to. Oh my god, Takata, seriously. He's accepted me to learn everything he knows. I work hard every day to practice the craft. He really does know a lot. What can you tell me about Garant? Only that his family has been jealous of Rangar's for as long as any of us can remember. Instead of learning from Rangar and trying to improve his own skill, Garant simply pouts and gets jealous. Sure. Last I heard, he had left town, all too conveniently right before Rangar's father's masterpiece goes missing. What filth. Um... We're gonna get to Skyrim? Last I knew, there was someone at the docks that still ran the boat between Skyrim and Falskar. You should speak with them. Okay. Come back if you need to sharpen your weapon or patch up your armor. <sighs> Kata, honest to God. You're such a pain in the butt. Um, anybody else around? Oh, this must be the Jarl's place, huh? I'm just guessing because it's the biggest place in the territory. Boldalore Manor. Let's go check it out. Enjoy being young. If you say so. Do not fret, Wilhelm. You will grow up to be a great warrior. I am sure of it. But only if I keep practicing. I'll go do that right now. What is it? Agnar says if I'm going to make a good king, I'll need a strong lady by my side. I was thinking of Varna. Ever seen a dragon? A 
dragon? No. But if I ever do, I'll fight him and show him how tough I am. I wish they were real. That'd be so cool. They're pretty real, all right. Watch out for nasty bandits. Alma? Do you need something? A house in the city, 8,000 gold. What do you do around here? I manage a lot of the land and policies under Ragnar. I make sure the guards are paid, the taxes are collected, and that the people are happy. Though recently I have also been helping many people through the hard economic times. If they can't pay taxes, or are at risk of going out of business, I work with them. I help keep Svea's shop, Helena's market stall, and even the Reynolders farm running. Svea's shop. I need to talk I to Svea. I haven't heard from the Reynolders in a long time. I hope they are right. Um, may I have a copy of the bounty ledger? Sure thing. We make the bounty information public to everyone. Here's a copy of the ledger. Cool. Thank you. Um, should I get a... What's that about the Rendorlians? Anneke and Lena Reynolder run a farm just northwest of Borvold. They do most of their trade there, but from time to time they stop by to say hello and trade with the townsfolk here in Amber Creek. Many people here are their friends. However, they haven't stopped by in a long time, and I'm starting to wonder if something has happened to them. I wouldn't be surprised with all this bandit activity lately. I don't mean to order you around, but could you please stop by their farm the next time you're in that area? Sure. I just want someone to check in on them and make sure they are right. I'd owe you if you did so. No worries. Um, maybe I'd like to purchase home in the city. I'm sorry, but we don't know you well enough to allow that. With how many bandits and attacks are there right now, we have to be careful. Don't take it personal. Get to know everyone here and help around town. If you show that you have good intentions, we can talk. Alright, fair enough. Um. Be careful out there. So I got some new books. Let's see. Bounty Ledger. Done. Hmm. Okay. Doesn't say anything. Not really sure what that means. Um. What was the other thing I got? I got a note from somebody. Special stew. Spectral arrow. Sure, we'll learn that. Why not? Um, what was that note? Hmm. I guess it wasn't an actual, or I guess we didn't get it. Just told about it. Okay, where'd the Yarl go? That's not the Yarl, that's Sophia. There he is. Hey, Agnar. Greetings. We found Mechanus. He said the bandits are working for Nagvar. What? What led him to believe that? Such a statement cannot be taken lightly. He overheard them talking. They got orders from Yagnar to capture him. This, this is bad news. It could very well mean the start of another war. Thank you for bringing me this information. Please, accept this token of my appreciation. I hate hey, that Hunter more Gold. of you. You have already saved one of my people. But I don't have much choice. Long ago, when there was war between my family and the Yunvaldirs, mm. there was a group of monks that served as our wise men and court wizards. Wizards. They have since retired to a simpler life. But their roots are still there. They may know what Ingvar is up to. Okay. Please, go to Balin Priory, to the southwest, and talk to Brother Thorlo. See if he knows anything. Alright. Um... An army of greed. Takata, quit freaking out. Have you spoken with Brother Thorlo yet? No. But I was hoping to talk to you a little bit more, but alright, never mind. 
You don't want to speak with me? Fine. Okay. You're Halma. I know you already. I guess I've spoken with everybody here, huh? Okay. All good. Um, I guess we're out. I would like to find Sphea, wherever the hell she is. Gabriel. Greetings. Um, no. Safe travels. Oh, he's got the extra horse. Um, yeah, sure. Okay, that's the Jarl's place. Where's... More horses over here. Where's Svea's shop? I need to speak with her. Berg's house. Um, general goods. Okay, let's see if this is it. There you are. If you need any supplies, please let me know. Someone mentioned a ring that you still own. What? What's that about? Yes, Harold, I assume. He's looking for it, but it belongs to my family. He may want it, but if you find it, I'd very much like to buy it from you. Hmm, hmm. I have some questions about the ring. Okay, ask whatever you like. Do you know where the ring, ring might be? No. If I had any idea, I would have searched for it long ago. The merchant vessel carrying it sunk in a terrible storm. Anything else you want to ask? I'll share anything that might help you find the ring. Where exact why, why exactly did your family have a giant ring of amber? It was the first of the amber ore that was extracted from the river when the town was founded. The blacksmith took it and in honor of the town's success crafted my family a great suit of armor with the ring attached to the back. Anything else you want to ask? I'll share anything that might help you find the ring. Um, what armor? You can see the chest piece up on the wall there. It has been worn by my family in every battle we have ever fought in. It broke my father's heart when we had to sell the ring from it. It's not only a symbol of our family, but of our entire town. It would be great to have it back. Anything else you want to ask? I'll share anything that might help you find the ring. When was the ring sold and why? It was 15 years ago. I was a young girl then. But I remember that day, Amber Creek was having a hard time getting by. A merchant came through with a great wealth to spend. My father saw an opportunity and decided to sell the ring. He didn't want to, but he had no choice. He gave everyone in town some of that money and kept us all out of truly dark times. Hmm. Anything else you want to ask? I'll share anything that might help you find the ring. Okay, I'll keep working on finding it. I'm ready to buy it whenever you do. Where's this chest piece? Oh, that must be it up there. Uh... Yes? What have you got for sale? Books, potions, armor, all sorts of goods. You got books? You do. Just spell tomes. Um... Lock picks, water skins, potion of cure disease. Um, sure. Anything you want to buy off of me? I mean, you know, yeah. How much does she have? Oh, she's got 1500. Okay. Um, but I don't know. Want a gold diamond ring? I don't need it. Sure, you can have that. Uh, necklaces. <sighs> yeah. Here 
Here's a dark woods. Uh, look at all these rings, I'm not using them. I should probably use them. Um, Magicka, stamina. You can have that. You can have that. Um, yeah, okay. Bunch of potions. Get rid of that, we don't need those. Um, uh -huh. Okay, let's get rid of all this. Yeah, we're carrying around a ton, what ton of weight in potions. Um, Probably not necessary. I mean, I don't know. Frostbite venom. Let's get rid of the venom. I don't know. Sleeping tree sap. Oof. I probably use some of these things while I'm in combat, you know what I mean? Fortify alteration. Aye aye. Alright, I mean, you know, it's all good. Take the scrolls, I don't ever need. Oh, oh. Never mind. You have no more money. Thanks. Maybe I'll see you at the inn later. So yeah, you were just the person I wanted to talk to. Okay, well I don't necessarily want to make this entirely an episode about talking with people. Where do you suppose the docks are? Hot springs. Um of Holmar. Where's this place I was supposed to go and check out the bandits and whatnot? Where are these docks? I mean, I don't know if they're supposed to be, like, right here. I don't know. Um, uh, we just north of the Um Wolf. Wolf. I don't know where he is. Oh gosh. Bunch of way the hell down here. There's no way down there. Except to go all the way up here. Super. Well really not much for it, but to go all that way. Um, some dude just wants to sell it, and Svea wants to buy it because it's part of her family. I'm more inclined to sell it to her than I am to give it back to that guy. What time is it? It's 5.46 p.m. Maybe what we'll do is... It's going to take a while to get there. 
Yes, indeed. Um, we'll just follow this road. See if we run across anything interesting along the way. I think we picked up most of the quests in that little town. It just looks like about half the quests in uh, all of all of the mod. Something's ahead of us. I hear wolves. Who are you? You're a guard. Okay, more vault is that away. Maybe we should go to more vault. There's supposed to be something we're supposed to find there. Oh, we're supposed to stop in at a farm. Who are you? Another guard. Um, let's check that out. Just northwest of Borvald across the river. Alright. Yeah, there they are. We can check in on, on them. Sure, why not? As long as we're heading that way. Let's go see what there is to see. Something's coming up. Maybe that's Borvald. into the tower here. Let's go see what this is. Okay, take two. So bandits in here, guys. And one of them cheated. Hello. I would leave the joke to come here. Not fast. Oh yeah. Sit down. Who's shooting at me? Get out of here, Kajit. Kajit. Yeah, piss off. Mr. Marauder dude. So he was hitting pretty hard, I have to admit. Um, there's a dead rabbit. Mr. Pilferer. Come here, arrows. Where's the other one? Thanks, Takata. That was good timing with the healing. They did well. Fifty septum. Nice. Um, anyone else? Anyone else? Uh, ooh, money. Bear pelt. Well, I don't need bear pelts. I do not need cheese. And potatoes. And roast horse haunch. And goat cheese. And they can get the rest of your stuff. Um, skooma and moon sugar. Take your ingots and your leather. It's in the barrel. Salt. Take that. What's in here? Come on, pop that baby open. 16 septum. More septum. Ooh, more chests, man. Nice. Take all your stuff. You guys are rich. Alright, that seems to be about it for up here. I don't know what the deal is with this tower, but apparently I cleared it up. Yep. 
solve your little bandit problem. Yeah, this was the dude who cheated. Or one of them did. Rat bastard. Okay, um... That's all well and good. Ogrim's Tower. Okay. Well, it seems to be done. Right, we're returning on our quest to go check out the farm. Let's see what the deal is with these guys. False car guard. Where are we? Uh, this is a ways away. Still. Or vault. Yeah, whatever. It's not like we got any place else to go. Um, I'll probably wrap it up pretty soon, guys. I know this has been mostly a, you know, talking to the people episode. Which I cannot tend not to be the, the most exciting in the world, but, um, you know, it's gotta be done. heading down that, um, that cliff thing. Must be down to the lower section. in this direction. Okay, that one and this one. Yeah. Okay. In a little ways we should be coming up on a river. You don't see as many Khajiits about these days. I guess they must have gone elsewhere. Do we get it? Elsewhere? Elsewhere? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Sophia. Yes, I... Oh, what's going on here? Hello? Bandits. Hey, you! Please, help me! What's up? Thank the nine someone finally came by. I've been out here for days. I was on my patrol when I heard screaming down the road. I rushed over only to find a caravan under assault by bandits. I tried to help, but there were too many. I'm afraid I was wounded during the fight. Took a hefty blow to the stomach. The bandit must have thought he killed me because he moved on. After the fight ended, while they were looting the carts, I overheard them talking. The leader of the group was a dangerous marauder we've been trying to kill for months now called Jarek the Crusher. If you're off to find him, be careful. He and his gang are a dangerous bunch. They're holed up in Mammoth Keep, far to the northeast. Sure. If you have any potions you could spare, I'd be thankful. I'm afraid Jarek's hammer prevents magic from doing any good, so I need a tonic. Um... Here, have a potion of healing. This will get me started. Thanks. 
Now, please, leave me to bury the dead and pay my respects. Yeah, sure, no problem, dude. Um... So, what are we doing here? Um... Killjark the Crusher. Northeast of Bovald at the southern base of Mammoth Lake. Northeast of Borvald. Oh, there's Borvald. North... There, Mammoth Keep. Not so far from the Renault, there's... Okay, let's continue on south. Um, unless you want to, like, I can't see. Let's take this dude's septum and his lockpick. Bandit mage. Don't mind me, I'm just looting the dead. Hope you don't mind. Okay. I feel done. Um, we'll continue on. Let's see, we're heading south, right? Indeed. Okay, guys, I guess we should start thinking about wrapping this up. Uh, there's the river. Maybe what we'll do is get to the river, and I'll stop there. On the bridge. Um, because that'll be the next area, I think. It's starting to get pretty dark, though, I've got to say. What time is it? Uh, 7.30 at night. Sure, sure. Alright gang, um, where's my peeps? Where's Sophia? Where's Dakota? Yeah, just up the river is the, uh, these guys. Could probably save myself some time by going straight up to the, there, but I'll, I'll stick to the road, I think. We'll just go around this way. Um, Okay, let's save the game here. Okay guys, we did pick up a whole mess of new quests, which is kind of the opposite of what I was trying to do. <laughs> I was trying to actually get some of these quests off my books, but okay, whatever, it's fine. Um, Maybe what I should do is just turn on all the Falksar quests. Turn off everything else for right now. Jeez. It's a lot of stuff. I mean, look at all these quests we've got going. It's crazy. Um. Miscellaneous quests that belong to Falsar? I'm gonna say not. So just turn that off. Okay. Um, let's just take a quick look and see how we're doing on quests for this area. I'm just kind of curious. So we have completed quests one and two of the standard quests. Uh, we're starting quest three. Um, out of nine. Side quests, we got a bunch going. Um, we missed one in, in Amber Creek. Yeah, whatever, we have to go back there anyway. But we missed another one in Amber Creek. So basically, the remaining side quests are all either in False Car Docks or Amber Creek. 
Um, which, there you go. Yeah. Alright. I'm just out of curiosity. How many quests have we got going here? Here's the book. Uh huh. Alright. Pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, guys. Very nice. Alright, we're going to stop here. Um, let me take a minute to thank my patrons. My $5 plus patron is Michael Hillard. My $3 plus patrons are listed in the description below, along with any links that they've requested that I link to. Please do go check those out, guys. Good stuff in there. Um, and then finally, at the end of this episode, you'll see a list of all my $1 plus patrons. Thank you very much, guys. It is much appreciated. Without your support, this would be a much more difficult endeavor. So I do appreciate the help. Okay, guys. Um, we will stop here, and we will pick this back up in the next episode. So I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please take a second to comment, like, and subscribe. All these things really help me out. I'd like to say a big thanks to all my patrons whose names are appearing on the screen right now. Thanks a lot, guys. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more great content, consider joining my list of patrons. There's a link on the screen in the bottom left corner. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.